I did a video titled, Go Ahead, Defend Infinite Red Bull. And I literally sent my opponent infinite red balloons. And today, we're going to do go ahead, defend infinite regen rainbows. And we're going to be doing this in everybody's favorite game mode, Bonanza. And if you guys like this series, let me know by dropping a like on this video. And we're trying to hit 500,000 subscribers by the end of this year. And we're currently at this number right here. But with your help, we can hit it. So subscribe. Okay, we got the perfect opponent because who uses Sentai Churchill and Bonanza? I'm sorry. But I also want to hit him with the late game question mark emo. I know, I'm being a menace to society here because I am lying so hard when I ask this question. But I'm looking for, you know, a thumbs up. Okay, he's just going to ignore me. Oh, don't worry. I'm not done spamming it. I will spam it if I have to for the entire game until I get some, like, just response, bro. Please. Yep, he's a bot. He's utilizing a balloon bot. Oh, okay. Good luck. Good. What does that even mean, dog? I'm asking in the late game. Like, you definitely have got to have, like, a thumbs up emo or, okay, wave. Does that mean no? And, like, by the way, you put down a balloon bot and you're actually not even... Yeah, there. There we go. That's exactly what I was looking for that entire time, bro. Let me go ahead. Do I have, like, a thumbs up emo? Yes, I do. Beautiful. Anyway, let's get down our first farm here. Oh, he's also farming, too. Okay, so maybe this guy isn't as bad as I thought. I definitely could have went for this farm like a long, long time ago. Okay, well, <laughs> you don't want to be spamming 000 farms. Okay, you're just going to continue on doing that. You know what? One way or another, however, you're going to be making money. So I guess that is good. Your placements are really bothering me though because they are not pixel perfect at all. Okay, NG. So NG farm, what could your last tower be? Probably the super monkey. So... There's actually a really good chance that you're going to defend against infinite regen rainbows, which, yes, is exactly what we're going to be doing. We are not going late game. Even though I asked this guy like 100 times to go late game, I, again, was completely lying because I want to end this game on round 13 because round 13 is the first round that we're going to be able to send regen rainbows, okay? Also known as the RROD, which is the regen rainbow of death. Or maybe it's Rainbow Rush of Death. That would make more sense. Anyway, we could already use our level 3 ability here, so might as well use that because why not? Got up the double banana plantation too as well. So we're looking pretty good so far. I'm still just chilling with the 000 dartling gunner, which is kind of crazy, but maybe for safety measures, let's go ahead and go with the powerful darts here. I mean, we're out farming this guy already by quite a bit. And we are out ecoing him too as well. Typically, when using farms, you actually want to space eco uh, during the earlier game rounds. However, since we are in Bonanza, we get double income. So we have enough money to constantly max eco while also going for a ton of different farms. Okay, so let's go with another farm right here. Beautiful. Round 7 is already here. So I don't think I want to stop my eco game at all. Because if I do, then he might be a little bit more cautious. Uh, because typically when people stop their eco, then you're more likely to rush, right? So I don't think I'm going to stop my eco game literally at all. Okay, the balloon adjustment is already starting to kick in over on his side too as well. So got the first blood because of that. I'm not really concerned about that, but he ended up going for a cleansing bomb. Still has yet to reveal uh, that third and final tower, however, which again, most likely it's going to have to be the super monkey, you know? Um, but round nine, let's transition into pink ego now. Let's go for a central market over on my side. Beautiful. And as for my defenses, I'll probably just go ahead and go with a Hydra Rocket Pods over on my side. Why are you going for a bank? You plan on going for an IMF load or something, bro? You better not. I asked you to go late game, dude. <laughs> I'm definitely not going to break that promise. <laughs> okay, just to be safe, because it's round 11, he could actually send us purples. Let's go for the Hydra Rocket Pods. Highly doubt he would. He's still just sending group reds. He has been uh, for the entire game, pretty much. But do I dare try to go for the Monkey Wall Street here? I probably could, which that would give me $20,000 at the start of the next round. So, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Beautiful chat, okay? But round 13 is about to be here, which is the first round that I can send Regen Rainbows. So, let's go ahead and click this button down here. And click this button down here. And let's get this end the young man. Infinite Regen Rainbows with the increased regrow rate. Because we have Star Captain Jericho. Looks like the Regen Rainbows are pushing through. And he's going to end up going down. Did he even try to go for like a Super Monkey or anything? Oh, wait. Let's see how he reacts. Is he going to be upset? Or is he just not going to say anything, bro? Let me just hit him with the late game again. 
We have met his baby! No! I know it's a little foggy, but he has a sniper, dude. Okay, sniper is definitely going to be one of the better towers for him in order to defend against regen rainbows. Now, I forgot to mention in the last game that at level 4 on Star Captain Jericho, he increases the regen or regrow rate of regrow balloons. I kind of just want to upgrade to it right now just so I can show you guys. So look, at level 4, regrow balloons sent to your opponent regenerate faster than normal. So that's kind of ultimately why I wanted to have Agent Jericho, or Star Captain Jericho, I'm sorry, as my hero because sending regen rainbows and having that increased regeneration rate is definitely going to be helpful especially in a game mode like bonanza guys nobody should ever die to regen rainbows in bonanza where you start off with double income you get double income for banana farms and stuff like that so you just have an absurd amount of money i mean heck you're supposed to even defend against regen rainbows in just like normal rank slash casual so if you can't defend against regen rainbows in bonanza where you have practically double the money that's just pretty crazy in my opinion okay but that's kind of why i wanted to do this as a video and we once again are gonna try to send the regen rainbows immediately on round 13 but we might have to switch things up a little bit maybe send like camo regen rainbows or something like that okay wait he's sending us group greens here so i'm gonna probably have to upgrade you yeah let me go for another dartling gunner as well oh my gosh my game has been like really laggy sorry yo wait this guy is sorry and i didn't oh my gosh i didn't even spam the late game he's sorry for making me leak their weight oh this is gonna be bad okay well let's hit him with the late game question mark emote then I, I really did completely forget about that. <laughs> oh, yes, this is so perfect, bro. This is so perfect, bro. This guy is super, super responsive. I mean, our last opponent, he did respond, but he, he didn't want to talk too much. Maybe he was a little shy. Let's go. Oh, I did not mean to send that once again. We already got the thumbs up from him. Let's go ahead and use that level three ability there. Round seven is here. Yeah, my farms and everything just aren't as good as they were in the last game. I don't know what the heck it is, boys, but my computer has been, like, laggy. Maybe it's time to upgrade, bro. Battles 2, it's actually hard on your computer, which is kind of crazy to say. A monkey pop and balloon game requires a pretty decent PC, bro. Um, round 7 yellows. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Okay, wait. We're good here, right? We're good here, right, chat? Go for another powerful darts, because I guess we're not good. He did go for the OP sniper as well. Which that OP sniper over time can get overran by region rainbows. Okay, it's round nine now. Oh my, yeah, this is really laggy. Holy crap. But I probably won't. Sorry again. Why is he sorry for making me leak, dog? <laughs> now, I, you're making me feel even worse, dude, about doing this. I can't lie. Okay, let me just stop decoying. If he stopped decoying, I think it's okay if we stop decoying. So let's go ahead and go with that. Surely he doesn't send me purples or anything, right? I used my level 3 ability, so I sent a few more group blues right there. He went for a banana research facility. Okay. I was going to say that's kind of crazy, but I guess he can get away with it. Okay, round 12 is here. We might be able to sell uh, into the monkey Wall Street once again. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and do that here in a second. Okay, got it. Beautiful. And then I'll go for the HRP on my side just to be safe. And now let's send the regen rainbows right here, right now. Okay, balloon boost them as well. Balloon boost them as well, baby. Increased regrow rate. He could go for elite defender. He went for elite defender. I repeat, he went for elite defender. But can the re... No, he's mad. He's mad. I'm sending camos. No, he defends. No. No, I'm not stopping. I don't care. They're pushing through slowly, but surely he's going to go for a super monkey. What? Yep. Yeah. No. No, it did not work, dude. Okay. 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 I'm going to have to just end this game then as soon as I can, bro, because he has the life advantage. Oh, he sold it. Wait. Why would he sell that? Send more. Send more then. Oh, okay. He's just going to rebuild it probably. I'm with. Yep. Okay. He just wanted to rebuild it. Oh, my. No, now he's trying to do it to me. Nope. Not enough. Not enough, brother. Wait, I have an idea. Let's like upgrade star captain like a lot here and then we can use this level 10 ability here oh wait 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 this is kind of genius this is kind of genius wait i think i might be cooking chat i think i might be cooking however i want to go all the way to level 20 here if i can 
So let's upgrade your loot to level 20. Beautiful. Because look, Smuggler's Run can load $25,000 worth of balloons into Jericho's spaceship, including BADs. Its cooldown is also reduced. 745 BADs are now more durable than normal. Obviously, we don't have to worry about the BAD part, but that Smuggler's Run is my level 10 ability, essentially. So my plan is to send him like as many region rainbows inside the spaceship as we can go for but on round 19 i'm gonna do that okay i know i'm not even like upgrading my farms or anything i'm kind of all over the place at the current moment but when we use that level 10 ability it's gonna spawn like 15 percent or maybe 20 percent uh the way through his track so it's not gonna spawn at the direct like start of the map if that makes sense okay so i'm gonna go ahead and use this ability right now and we can load twenty-five thousand dollars worth of region rainbows as you can see the spaceship is slowly but surely filling up oh my gosh i can send so many of these oh wait oh they turn into region oh <gasps> balloon boost please regrow like crazy no no i tried chat oh that was our chance that was our chance. We could try again, but it, it's just going to get harder and harder, dog. Harder and freaking harder. Okay, round 20's here. Oh, no. Dude, he's laughing again. Stop it, bro. <laughs> Stop laughing at me, man. Okay, so I can send, like, even more. So I guess I'll send, like, just more expensive region rainbows, okay? So we can fill it up even more. Okay. Look, this one. They, dude, he instantly popped them. Oh my gosh. Oh, yeah, there's nothing I can do. Later. All right, send him a Fortify BED here immediately. Remember, level 20, uh, Fortify BEDs are more durable. Okay, so that's why we're going to do that. Then I'm going to use my level 10 ability. Send that into hyperspace. And send these regen rainbows into hyperspace. Beautiful. I don't know what he's doing. Yes! Yes! Regen camo rainbows somehow kill him! Regen camo rainbows somehow kill him! Which are now regen camo ceramics, by the way. Oh my gosh. Wait, they're pushing. They're pushing, chat. I'm not even trolling, they are. I'm not even trolling, they are. Oh my... And he is a legend of the night. He is a legend of the freaking night, which is gonna have a black hole. Okay, now he's shredding. <laughs> Now he is absolutely shredding. He must not realize that the black hole can only suck up, pause, one uh, fortified BED or just BED in general. He just laughed too, by the way. Oh, you're in for a very rude awakening, my friend. You're in for a very, very rude awakening. Watch this. Watch this, guys. Okay. I, I, I wish he would die to my region rainbows, though. I wish, dude. He just tower boosted. Give it a minute. Black hole spawns. Nope. <laughs> I don't have the... Oh, yes, I do. I'm the one that can laugh now. Who got the last laugh? It was me. Even though uh, we kind of failed today's challenge in this video. Okay, I think I have a good understanding, though, of what I want to do here in the final game. Hopefully, the final game. But let's go ahead and start off with a farm here so that we can immediately get that extra banana. Uh, from that farm i'm locked in chat with this one of course though you guys can't see yeah sniper and as you saw in the last game that guy was able to fully defend okay he has super yeah no surprises there i'm more okay with seeing the super monkey uh versus the sniper because if you think about it although the super monkey is pretty op one it's still pretty expensive and two we can send those camo regen rainbows if he has bad camo defenses you know but he also does have the village so he has a lot of late game potential going on uh, within this strategy however he still has yet to even send us a singular balloon but let's go for another farm here now unfortunately on a map like this guys there's very very limited farm space but if we only plan on going to round 13 then i guess at the same time we don't really need all that many farm spots to begin with. But boys, I want to go for that Smuggler's Run, so that level 10 ability at least on Star Captain Jericho to send that Regen Rainbow Rush into hyperspace, aka teleport it like 15% the way through the track to try to catch him off guard. If I initially did that in the last game, I think I might have just killed my opponent because he would have had less time to react 
to that rush. I mean, we still got the win, but it was like, you know, not in the way, of course, that we wanted. Round five is here. Let's go ahead and blow up this island because, of course, we just do not need that. We're not going to be utilizing that. And I was definitely late uh, to use my level three ability, but I think it's fine. This guy still hasn't sent me a singular balloon. However, he is going to get money uh, from having the village because he's going to go for the village farm upgrade. So I guess fair play well done with that. So maybe we do just stop Eco win anyway. I know, like, if we never technically, like, not stop our Eco game, then, like, he's less likely to be aware initially of when I'm going to be rushing him. If that kind of makes sense. But I, I feel like at the same time, if we want to go for that smuggler's run, I think I should just upgrade all the way to level 20. Or actually, no, I shouldn't. I should just go to level 10. Because I forgot that uh, Star Captain Jericho, he's going to change our region rainbows into regen ceramics i don't necessarily want that which i hope he doesn't do by level 10 i'm not honestly sure off the top of my head at this current moment but let me go ahead and hit that 2000 eco mark beautiful with the year that i was in fact born he's going for more sniper farms though guys there's a chance man i mean if he goes for that elite defender the elite defender is gonna have a really easy time uh just defending in general okay i might just tank these lives here so i can go for this yep beautiful so i can get twenty thousand dollars at the start of round 11 round 12 and round 13. so you can take that uh first blood there that's absolutely fine with me let's go ahead and not upgrade him yet actually i'm not even gonna go for any more farms either it doesn't really matter i, I guess we can upgrade to him um level 10 at the start of the next round because he actually might auto level himself up to eden level seven here okay yeah now he's level seven so level eight level nine and level 10 let's go ahead and use this ability here and load up as many regen rainbows as we can into the spaceship as you can see it's almost filled okay that should be it that should be it right where is it okay balloon boost okay send them send re send camo send camo send camo send camo send camo yes Yes, because he has a sun avatar. No, he's going to be able to go for the gamma detection. Uh, come on. They're pushing slowly but surely. They have the increase regrow rate. They're making it past the Ben, past the sun avatar. All he has to do is go for the radar scanner on the village, and then he's going to be absolutely fine. But I think we're going to end up getting the win, even though we did not because of the level 10. I should have initially sent camos, but the video was about region rainbows, not camo region rainbows. But anyway, I still feel like that counts, and that was just a great overall game. Although I forgot to ask him late game. I did forget to do that, but that's okay. GG's nonetheless. And if you haven't already, make sure to check out this video where I played in every arena in Balloon City Battles 2.